Sometimes I find myself wondering if there is an official grading system for the imagination. So if you have particular tendencies in the mind, then they'll label it this kind of imagination. You have other tendencies against that kind of imagination. Personally, mine, I would say, is very, very vivid, extremely vivid. The quality of something I imagine is exactly the same as um, a memory. And I suppose this has a good side and a bad side. It means you can think of anything. But the bad side, for example, when I was younger, is that reality and imagination would get blurred, which would lead to some serious trouble and <laughs> some stupid excuses. Um, also, as a young man, I remember external inputs, shall we say, could send my imagination down this really dark path. It, it created a reality that wasn't there, but I was reacting physically to, a, to something that didn't exist, and that was very weird. Uh, I think uh, people have panic attacks, or I don't know, people have strange phobias. Uh, the imagination can do that. You know how it is where there's a dark space and you know there is nothing there, but your brain would just fill it in and put a werewolf there or put any kind of something. So, you know, that's the sort of heavy side of a vivid imagination. Uh, one of the nice things is that you can never get bored. It doesn't matter what. You just, it just flies off and you end up doing something. Um, uh, also, I think it helps me with writing. The way I write, I, I need to build a world. So in the case of now I am here, I had to build this, this whole uh, country with a, a way of being, with a political system, etc., etc. And I put that together and then I could uh, create the story. Um, for example, there is, uh, narrator is a war criminal, yet I don't spend time going into detail about, you know, going into the bloody detail or the gory detail of what he has done. That's all implicit. Yet, I did need to picture it, um, and I'm glad it was only the imagination, I did need to picture it in order to avoid it. So yeah, that's, um, again, I don't know if there's a true grading system, but uh, yeah, I'll think about that, and I think I'll return to the matter at some point in the medium to near future.